A few months ago, I designed a boomerang, and one day, I threw it around campus. Turns out, people actually wanted to buy my boomerang. How much money would you buy this for? I'm just curious. $25. $25. It's lit. And despite me being an introverted engineering student, I decided to dabble in sales. On that same day, my friends and I were selling cup holders, which didn't go so well. Oh, never mind. So, yeah, I didn't really have a plan then, but I mean, we made $11. So I'll take it. This time, I'll have a plan for my boomerangs. And this time, I know people will buy. So here's plan A. My friends and I will go to our campus's volleyball field and demo the boomerang there. Why the volleyball field? Because that's where sporty people are. And when they see us throwing an object that defies how things normally fly, they will have their minds blown. And hopefully that will get us a big crowd and some sales. If that plan doesn't work, which how can it not, we have plan B. We go to a huge field in the middle of campus and throw the boomerang there. The huge open field will hopefully let many people see the boomerangs and become interested. From there, we will hopefully get a crowd and some sales. Plan C is to have me and my friends throw boomerangs all at the same time so that it can attract more attention. This can be done during plan A or plan B. So this plan's pretty crazy, but it's gonna be fun. I mean, just throwing boomerangs all at the same time with my friends, hopefully not hitting anyone. Plan D, D for desperate, is having my friends pretend that they like the product. This will hopefully attract a crowd because when people see a crowd of other interested people, they themselves become interested. And that leaves us with plan E, which is to literally beg people to buy our boomerang. And um, hopefully we never get to that point, but if it does, then at least we have a plan. Thing is, me and my friends are just engineering majors, ill-equipped for sustained social interaction, much less going up to strangers and asking them to literally spend money. Not just any strangers, but college students. I mean, they're ruthless. Oh my goodness. First try. And they're broke. I literally have no cash. Well, okay, maybe not the ruthless part, but definitely the broke part. Meaning that me and my friends will have to pull some miracles out there. But despite the challenges, I have the power of friendship on this endeavor. So, without further ado, let's roll. Literally. This video is sponsored by PCBWay. More on them later. Now, last time I threw a boomerang on campus, people came up and actually wanted to buy it. And that's where my plan A will be. There's literally no one here. All right, off to a great start. Um, plan A failed immediately, so I guess time for plan B. But first, I'm gonna have to train up my friends on how to throw a boomerang, which, I don't know, might attract some people in the process. All right, so. I gotta train my friends to uh, my friend Simon here. Hello. Yeah. Oh. Don't hit so much. <laughs> Let's go. Maybe uh, put some more oomph into it. Okay. Like Time baseball two. pitch. Here we go. Here we go, Simon. You got this. You got this. That was not enough. <laughs> Attempt number six. No way. Better. Wait, yep. that's like baseball. I'll throw around frisbee. There's a. Like yeah, you want to try? Yeah, Let's see it. No, oh. <laughs> 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 that's, that's no, no, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, yes, no, no, it's so close. The tactic is working, Simon. <laughs> oh, oh. All right. I just thought, I thought it was cool. We got to train uh, Ojazvi here, and also Simon and Logan, who has some CS work to finish. I guess we'll get to him last. Third, third time. Oh, that's the wind as well. <laughs> here we go, Logan. Wait, Let's go. Oh, wait. Ah. Okay, here we go, Logan. Yes, yes, yes. Oh my goodness. But then someone came to sabotage everything. My boomerang business that isn't booming, my plans A through E, everything was falling apart. The university mascot. I think that he or she was trying to snip my boomerang business at the bud by distracting my friends from training. Just kidding, it ain't that serious. A few of my friends had to leave anyways, leaving only me and Ojazvi to take on the campus. Engineering majors be like, um, you wanna buy this thing? Folder. I mean, it's like, oh, never mind. So you can just put it in there? Never mind. 
Hey, you guys look like you throw footballs really well. You, you want to throw a boomerang? I mean, yeah, I try. I right. do it. I, I've never thrown one before. You flick your wrist, like very fast, so that it could spin like this. Oh! You guys will probably be better at catching it, because you know. I don't think I'll be able to get it back. Okay, yeah. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, designed it and 3D printed. Yeah. All right. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. That's fine. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah. You gotta like just flick it like that. Yeah, just kind of yeah. flick it and like make sure it's vertical. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> That's No way, new customers. That. Uh, yeah, I think I got changed. One for you, one for you, and there we go. Uh, what are your names? I'm Sam. Sam. My name's Oli. 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 Okay. Jackson. Jackson. What's your name? Uh, Ryan. Ryan. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you guys so much. This yeah, really appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. Now, you might be wondering how you can get your hands on one of these boomerangs. Well, luckily for you, I have an Etsy store that has four physical boomerangs in stock because I sold most of them throughout the video. But I also have SDL files for anyone with a 3D printer. What if you don't have a 3D printer? Well, introducing PCBWay, the sponsor of this video. Apart from manufacturing your PCB designs, you can also send them an STL file to have them 3D printed for you. They have many different printing processes and materials. For the boomerang, you only need the basic PLA using FDM printing. And it seems like it only costs around $9 to print. If you need your design to be made in metal, you can use PCBWay CNC services and metal 3D printing services. And if you need your design to be made into an electronic board, well, PCBWay definitely has you covered with their PCB services. All right, back to the video. Literally cannot believe it. We actually got $15. You got money? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, did you even give them the cup holder? No. They're, like, I offered that to them if they wanted. Oh, they're trying it. Wait, let's see, let's see. Out of nowhere, Plan C was in action. As we were all having fun throwing the boomerangs around, it attracted a crowd. Let's go. I just want to be another customer, by any chance. Dude, I literally have no cash. I've got AirPods in you my You have Venmo feet. or Zelle? I have PayPal? Zelle. I do. Oh. You have Zelle? No. Hey, yeah. Because you don't want money. Don't wait, 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 wait. Venmo? Okay. okay. All right. Oh, oh. customer four. That's great. Yeah, pay, pay ten and do two. This isn't an advertisement. No sponsorship. Just no way. People came up to it. Him. <laughs> yeah, no, Rick, no, yeah. We'll, we'll split it. We'll no, split, no, split, split, split it. But yeah, he's like it. It it ten, it He's the executioner. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna try and catch one. You're gonna try to catch it. No, no, like, Wait. what if you catch it, right? And then <laughs> yeah. same frame? Oh, yeah, and then... Then you go to the play you're still then... the same frame. And oh, transition, transition. Yeah. That's good, that's good, that's good. Here you go. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, oh, oh. oh shoot. <laughs> oh, sorry. All right, we'll try it. I'm trying to catch it as well. All right, that was a successful run, but now it's time to run back to plan A at the volleyball field. Now, you might be wondering why I'm running. Well, my friend Logan, who had to leave earlier, is going to meet me there at 5 p.m. to buy one of my boomerangs. It's currently 4.55, and I'm across campus from there. Well, we made it, and Logan got his boomerang, so everyone's happy. <laughs> there we go. How was the, the uh, first drive of that boomerang? There's it was no amazing. Nice. Well, I'm at the volleyball field and there's people here, so might as well execute plan A. Oh, let's go. Oh, no. Oh, let's go. No one bought any boomerangs, unfortunately. 
but one person did show interest though. I guess it's time to go home. At the end of the day, me and my friends sold seven boomerangs. All right, some of them actually bought the boomerangs, but let's just ignore that for now. We made about $35 total, so not too bad for one and a half hours. But I guess what really mattered was how much of a good time we had together, sharing in the joy of the boomerang. I did not expect people to be so receptive with the boomerang, especially after the first time I had done something like this with cup holders. Thank God I did not let that discourage me. 